coast. Uh, high pressure is just kind of confining it here. We're seeing a little bit filter into parts of Soledad, but it's not much at all. Most of the cloud cover is at around 800 feet, and we're seeing a marine layer of the warming at around about 1,000 feet or so. So uh, up in the upper elevated areas, they're seeing some very good temperatures. 38 in Lake Tahoe to 71 in Las Vegas. Very nice, uh, comfortable night for folks in the Central Valley. The Big Valley did really well. 57 in San Francisco and 67 in Los Angeles. Temperatures uh, will fare nicely today because of the high pressure building in from the desert southwest. The Great Basin also just kind of pumping in that, that offshore flow. We'll see a lot of sunshine and those warming temperatures coming in. So a lot of folks in the Central Valley might be heading here to the Central Coast for a little bit of relief for the next couple of days. All that moisture we just had in Arizona now filtering out of the Rockies and cutting across in the Midwest. It has caused some severe weather in parts of uh, Nebraska all the way down into Iowa and Missouri. They had some thunderstorms and uh, some damaging winds and tornadoes. And now we're seeing all that moisture continue to press on and it's going to bring in some more of that hail and up to about three inches of rainfall in about six hours time. 46 in Bismarck to 81 in St. Louis. That means we've got some pretty strong winds cutting across there as well. 84 down in Dallas and much warmer as you get into Miami and New Orleans. Temperatures here. Redding's going to pick up triple digits today. 103 in the deserts. That's no, uh, no uh, secret there. 94 for Las Vegas and everybody else getting right back to near normal temperatures. Here you have it though. This is the next system that's going to come down and cool us down. But we're going to have a nice little warming trend until then. We're looking at about uh, Friday for that to start to stir up the, uh, the old uh, cloud cover again. We'll see the clouds kind of dissipate for a while and return back late Thursday getting into Friday and that means we get back to our summertime pattern. Here you have it though. Temperatures today mostly 60s, 70s and 80s if you get into the San Francisco Bay Area looking nice there and then all the way down into uh, San Jose 85 degrees we get past any type of uh, haziness. We'll see warmer temperatures in Gilroy 96, 87 in Hollister and a little hay balers right and then right back into uh, the Salinas uh, area we'll see 75 degrees warming it up to King City at 88 degrees Right back over to the peninsula. Here you have it, 68 PG, 70 in Seaside today. In Santa Cruz County, warmer up in the mountains in 77. A little bit cooler in Watsonville. Today, we'll get rid of the clouds that are on the coast. Sunny and warmer conditions for you. And your seven-day forecast, it's going to warm all the way into the weekend. But slightly cooler, though. But still, we're seeing 90s in our warmer spots along the coast. Here we have it, 60s and 70s and 80s all the way through. Let's take a look.